Hello, people. Um, I am finished editing the vlog, so that'll definitely go up today. And while that is exporting right now, I am cleaning my room and the balcony because um, someone's finally coming over to fix the screen. Someone's finally coming over to fix this screen so it can actually move. But yeah, so I'm just trying to make things a little bit cleaner for when uh, he comes over. Don't want it to be a huge mess. But yeah, so it's just a cleaning day. While I also listen to some Crazy Ex-Girlfriend because I really love Crazy Ex-Girlfriends. I've been like listening to this music nonstop all month. Man, this actually, there's actually a lot of clean. So maybe I should stop talking to you and just start cleaning. Uh, hi guys. Uh, unfortunately, he never came today to fix uh, my screen. I did still like clean. Um, it's definitely not what you would think would be clean, but it's definitely cleaner. I got rid of that big pile of clothes on the floor, put them all in there. Um, I also cleaned up all the trash, well most of the trash that was accumulating by my bed. I also got rid of some trash that was here. I cleaned up this area a little bit, also on my balcony. Look, no boxes. So I did clean, I did do some cleaning. I also took uh, like the three bags of trash that I had sitting over there. Oh my God, was I blurry the whole time? I'm sorry. This focus on this camera sucks, but there was like three bags of trash over here. I got rid of that, um, replaced it with the new bag and filled it with a ton of trash. So that might actually need to go out now. But he never came to fix the screen, so hopefully he'll come tomorrow. But anyway, right now I'm just catching up on some Zoella vlogs because I have missed out on two years of Zoella vlogs. I am that behind on her vlogs. But I absolutely love watching Zoella. She is just... Ugh, she makes me so happy. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna like head to bed really soon because I'm starting to feel tired. All right, hey guys, I just uh, finished work. I was only there for like a few hours. What is this person doing? Um, and now I'm on my way to the laundromat to do some laundry because I am out of clean underwear. Um, and then I'll go home and I don't know, just sit around, watch TV. Read. but I usually hate going to the laundromat like I hate it because it is usually filled with guys that try to hit on me and I just don't want that so hopefully that doesn't happen this time I just realized I haven't filmed it all today which I mean is totally fine I haven't been doing much, but uh, I did have work today, and today was my first day practicing my new case with the actual doctors. And I was kind of nervous to begin with just because I still didn't feel quite ready to just go in with the real doctors. Um, but I got even more nervous because it looks like my trainer is not going to be here all week. She unfortunately got jury duty, so I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> I'm starting to actually practice for realsies with the doctors and my trainer isn't here to let me know if I'm doing things correctly or to answer my questions if I have any and she's not going to be outside the little window watching the encounter with the doctors <laughs> and then she also has to watch every single encounter I do to be able to sign me off so I can actually start doing it for realsies and to have my scores and grades towards the doctors be real and not fake and pretend but it was just so frustrating because I was so nervous and I kept screwing up during my encounters with doctors today and so that just like made me even more nervous and the fact that like after every single encounter I had so many questions I was like did I answer that question correctly should I have answered it this way also if they do this does that count as this or does it not count towards that and it's just it's just frustrating and so I talked to like some of the other trainers um, unfortunately, like, none of them really know my case well enough to officially help me. They said they would help me as best they can. They would, like, look up my case for me while she's gone and try to help me out as best they can. But ultimately, it has to be my trainer that watches these and signs me off. I don't know if there's really anything else to update you guys on. I don't really 
really have that exciting of a life. <laughs> okay, so very exciting. The package has come in the mail and it's my Halloween costume. I don't want to show it to you because I don't want to ruin what my Halloween costume is this year. Um, but I'm excited. I really hope this fits just because um, I had to buy a boy's large. So let's hope I can fit into a boy's, not a man's, a boy's large. I should though. I checked the sizing chart. So it should just fit me, but I want to double check. I mean, maybe you do know what it is. Maybe me in the costume is a thumbnail of this video. So maybe you do know. Either way, in case it's not, I don't want to ruin it for you. So let me go see if this fits. Oh my god, it is actually a perfect fit. <gasps> like, it fits perfectly. I just hope it's not super hot on Halloween. Because I'm sweating in this. Also, by the way, this entire week has been like 100 degree weather. It's been so hot. I've been hating it, actually. Today's finally in the 90s. I can't wait to tell the people that I'm doing a group costume with that mine fits. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna do this off because I'm sweating. <laughs> it is now time to do some baking. Uh, as I'm baking, I'm going to be listening to a podcast. Um, I was just listening to a little bit of it. It's the Stuff You Should Know podcast, and it's the episode about giraffes. So I'm really excited to bake while listening to how giraffes work. Let's go bake some vegan brownies. Ooh. Okay, it turned out really good. I just hope it tastes good too. I love you too, Mom. Alright, bye. It was my mom's birthday today, so I was just talking to her on the phone. Um, sorry if the music is so loud. I am in a mall because I am about to have an interview. I'm so nervous because I suck at interviews. Like, I've never actually had a good interview. But, um, I'm also nervous just because I really need this job. I need it. I don't want it, but I need it. So let's go find who I'm supposed to have an interview with and get an interview and then I'll let you know how it goes afterwards. Ooh. Okay, so interview uh, apparently went well, but uh, I'm not gonna get it. She really liked me, um, but the issues with hiring me was the fact that A, I can't work during Christmas and New Year's because I am going back home to Pennsylvania around that time. Um, and also my other job, the schedule, the scheduling of my other job would be really hard to work with the scheduling of this job. Just the scheduling of like both jobs just didn't quite work well together. Um, I'm a little upset because I really did need another job, but I'm actually a little bit happy just because I did not realize that this position was commission only. I wanted a job that was more like I get a paycheck every week kind of a thing so we'll try to find something else that's the problem with applying for retail jobs right now because everyone is hiring for people who can work around Christmas time I thought I had applied for a job that wasn't like seasonal which means like it's okay to not work Christmas but like whatevs so I'm gonna go home and do some baking some more baking because I really like baking and I've got a lot of stuff to bake for tomorrow baking in the interview. The screen got fixed. Oh, hold on a sec. I locked it. Ready, ready, ready. Oh my god. Look at that. Yes. Oh. Look at that. With so much ease. So much ease. Almost got it off the track again. Right now it's time to just eat some dinner. 
take a shower, watch some TV, the whole spiel. Uh, so good night. <laughs> I'll just leave it here. Uh, tomorrow should be really exciting because it's a sleepover with Hannah and Kara and Halloween movies such as like Hocus Pocus, Halloween Town, you know, the classics, the classics. All right. I'll see you guys tomorrow. So I know I said the Saturday night was going to be a sleepover with Hannah and Kara and it was going to be so much fun. It got canceled. Hence why there was no footage yesterday. Um, I was kind of upset about it, uh, that it got canceled just because I had baked all that stuff, those vegan brownies, that Halloween funfetti cake. I even bought wine for the occasion. And then last minute, like very last minute, it got canceled. Instead, all I did was um, hang out here in my room all night. And I actually did drink that entire bottle of wine. <laughs> so I do not feel great this morning, but I did just eat some toast. I had some breakfast, I had toast, I had some strawberries. And I'm gonna spend today just doing work because I've got a bunch of stuff to read and take notes on. And it's honestly going to take me like a good week to do this. So I want to get as much done today as I can because I'm not going to have much time uh, the rest of this week to do it. So I want to get as much done of it as I can. So that's basically all I've got going today. I'm so upset. I wanted to have one night of like super fun times. And now I don't know what to do with like the brownies and the cake. I'm like, I can't eat it all by myself. I'm gonna go do work now instead of continuing to procrastinate by talking to you guys. <laughs> taking notes all day and I just can't read anymore. <laughs> I can't do it. I've read close to 200 pages so I only have a little over 100 left to go. I think I really don't know anymore. Um, but yeah, so now I'm just going to take a break for the rest of the night. I'm gonna watch a Halloween -y movie, maybe catch up on a little bit more TV because I'm still really behind. I'm still on like Wednesday. Um, I'm also wearing my Eagles jersey. I finally checked the mail today and it was there. So I'm very excited. The Eagles jersey is finally here. Thank you, mom, for sending it. Um, the Eagles had a game this morning at 10 a.m. I did not wake up until 10.30, so did not watch it. But we won. We beat the San Francisco 49ers 33 uh, to 10, which now makes Eagles 7 to 1. Yay! We won seven games, lost one game, so we're doing very well, which is great. Uh, the next game's not till next Sunday, and I think it's again going to be at 10 a.m., so I'll try to be up before then to watch it. I don't think any bars are going to be open at that hour, so I can watch it at a bar, but um, I'll hopefully watch it live. It's okay. I did watch the highlights of this game, so that's good. Anyway... Yeah, just gonna go make some dinner and possibly watch Hocus Pocus. I think that's the movie I'm planning on watching tonight is Hocus Pocus. Oh, I freaking love Hocus Pocus. It's such a good movie. All right, so it's Halloween and it's very exciting. I'm ready to put on my costume and my makeup. Uh, I am going to be a skeleton. That's kind of the costume there. You'll see it on me, but it's a group costume because I'm not just like a normal skeleton. I'm one of the skeletons from the SNL sketch David Pumpkins. So if you don't know that sketch, go watch that sketch. I'm gonna be one of like the b-boy skeletons. 
and I'm very excited. So I'm gonna get the costume ready. Only thing is I do not have like white for the full face type thing. So I might not be able to do that. I don't even have like black lipstick to put on the lips. So who knows what we're gonna do about that. But anyway, uh, yeah, so I'm going to become a skeleton right now. All right, it's now time to go. I just picked up or <laughs> I've just called my lift. Don't know when it's getting here. Actually, it's still loading. Oh, okay. Just says be outside ready soon. I don't know when she's coming, but uh, I'll have to show you a better version of my outfit because this is all I can really show you right now. But you're so excited! All right, let's go. That was insane. Sorry if you can't see me, it is pretty dark outside. Oh, I'm actually really out of breath. <laughs> oh, it's basically, that was a Halloween carnival in West Hollywood. I went as one of the skeletons from David Pumpkins. And can I just say what a great costume because so many people stopped us to take pictures. I felt like a celebrity. Anyway, now I'm just headed to a place where an Uber can pick me up and going home. again. Hi guys, I'm so sorry I never updated you after the doctor, but I did a hearing test, which is what you kind of saw. That was the room where I did a hearing test, and I did not do well on the hearing test. Something is wrong with my eardrum, and we're gonna, they, they think it might be allergies, but I'm not allergic to anything, so I'm gonna have to see an allergy specialist, which I'm debating on, but I now have to take Claritin and Flonase. And see if that helps but I won't know if that helps unless I go on a plane <sighs> but whatever um, but it's looking like I might actually have to get surgery which is definitely not something I need right now in my life because surgery always costs an arm and a leg also you're probably wondering why I'm wearing a hat it's because I dyed my hair tonight again um, this time I went with platinum and it did not go well. So I'm probably going to have to wear a hat until I get this fixed. Because it, I don't think it looks good. I'm just going to get back to watching YouTube. Because I really have been enjoying watching YouTube. Even though it is making me fall way behind on my TV watching and other stuff like that. Like, I'm still trying to catch up on Monday's TV. Mm, okay. I was able to figure out how to get the live Eagles game up on the screen. And I think I did it. It does start in like three minutes, I think. But I've got breakfast. 
breakfast looks weird. It's uh, still some of the Halloween Funfetti cake, ignore the pills, <laughs> with some strawberries that are cooked with honey, sugar, and cinnamon. We'll see how it tastes. I got the recipe from someone on YouTube. Um, yeah, so go Eagles. And while I'm watching this, I'm also going to try to multitask and edit the vlog. And maybe also edit, um, oh my god, the wrap-up video for October. Because I still have yet to do that. In the meantime, we will end this vlog with a time-lapse, I guess, of me watching the game.